Hey, hey, welcome to my channel. It's Carly and I'm back with another video for today I'm showing you some healthy low-calorie snacks. They're so good. They're delicious. I love them. They're quick. They're easy. They're fun to make Before we even get into the video make sure you press that red button down below Subscribe if you're not already because I would love to have you join the fam. So yeah, let's just get into the video First up is this frozen yogurt bark. It's so good. I made two different versions, one peanut butter, granola, and dark chocolate, and another with strawberries and dark chocolates. What you'll need is some Greek yogurt, strawberries, and some dark chocolate. I used lilies, and I covered a baking sheet with parchment paper. Then I add my yogurt on top, and I spread it into a thin layer. I then grab my strawberries and add it all over you could use any fruit that you want it doesn't have to be strawberries then i use my dark chocolate and i sprinkle it on top i put it in the freezer for about 30 minutes you could leave it for two hours overnight the outcome is the same but once it comes out you just want to break it up into pieces and then enjoy it it's such a delicious treat to have if you don't eat the whole thing you could put it in the freezer and it holds up very well in some tupperware this is how the peanut butter bark came out. It's so crunchy and so delicious. It is higher in calorie though, but it's so worth it. For the next snack, I made pizza chips. These are so good, so savory, crunchy, salty just yummy all around you only need two ingredients and that's cheese and pepperoni pepperoni and cheese the cheese that i like to use is craft and it's fat free so it's only 45 calories per serving which is so good so i use a serving of mozzarella and a serving of cheddar i put parchment paper on my baking sheet and put six piles of the mixed cheese with one slice of pepperoni I put it in the oven at 350 degrees for 8 minutes and put it on broil for the last 3 minutes. And this is how it comes out. They are so addicting, like I can't just have one. These chips really satisfy my pizza craving and I just love them so much. Next is this peanut butter banana rice cake the rice cake i use is from kim's magic pop and they're only 15 calories so i use two with powdered peanut butter and banana i like to use powdered peanut butter because it's only 60 calories i use two tablespoons of it with a tablespoon and a half of water then i just mix it up until it's the right consistency then i put it on my rice cake and I spread it all around evenly until I cover the whole surface and I add sliced bananas on top. I really like this treat because the rice cake is so light and airy and the peanut butter and banana is just so creamy on top. Next is this pita grilled cheese slash quesadilla. I use Joseph's mini pita and Sargento provolone cheese. I cut open my pita, slicing it along the sides. Then I open it up and add two slices of my provolone cheese. This cheese is only 40 calories per slice and the pita bread is only 50 calories. I add the pita bread onto my panini press. If you don't have one, you could use a toaster or grill it in a pan. But this is how it comes out. I didn't add any butter, but for some reason it just has like a buttery grilled cheese taste. It's so good and not to mention low calorie and quick to make. Next is frozen grapes. I like to prepare these at the beginning of the week. I just start by taking the grapes off of its stem and adding it into the freezer. 
once it's all frozen i like to measure out about a cup and add it into a bowl and snack on it throughout the day i like to eat them while i'm watching tv or just doing work they're such a delicious treat to have next up is this snack platter i like to make when i am indecisive about what i want to eat the possibilities are endless i just take whatever snacks that i am in the mood for and just put them together and compile a little platter i like to use fruits different types of crackers pepperoni cheese i really like to do this when i want something that's savory salty and sweet at the same time so i don't have to choose because your girl is indecisive but this is one of my go-to's literally you could just go in your pantry and pick out your favorite snacks and make your own combination and you could be in charge of how many calories each thing that you're putting on your plate is and just enjoy your snack so that is the end of my video i hope that you guys enjoyed it i really enjoyed creating this let me know down below what are some of your favorite low calorie snacks i would love to get some new ideas don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video bye loves Thank you.